Peggy 12. My name is Max Schaefer and I'm the CEO and founder of Vectra Games. And uh, gamers may also know me previously from Runic, where I also founded and created the Torchlight franchise. And before that, at Blizzard, where we made Diablo, Diablo 2, and uh, Diablo 2 Lord of Destruction expansion. After Torchlight 2 was completed, the uh, team at Runic Games decided to change directions a little bit and work on Hob, which was a, a wonderful single-player adventure game. But we felt like there was a lot more to do with the Torchlight universe and a, a lot of expansion that we could do with it. So uh, about two years ago, um, I left Runic and started a new studio here in San Francisco with uh, about 17 of my best friends and <laughs> uh, set up what I think is a great, great team uh, aimed specifically at doing wonderful things with the Torchlight franchise. To do justice to the Torchlight franchise and to take it to the next level, we really had to assemble an all-star team uh, that's capable of doing it. So coming to the Bay Area gave us a wonderful opportunity because in a sense we're able to get the band back together. So I've reunited with some co-workers that I worked with previously uh, who have worked on the Diablo titles for example. We got some of the guys from Runic to come down who worked on Torchlight and then we called up everyone we knew that was really good at this sort of thing and hired them and we've assembled a team that, that is uniquely qualified to make this sort of game. And so now I'm very, very pleased to announce to everybody that we are taking the next step with Torchlight and making an MMO, uh, an action RPG MMO, and it's called Torchlight Frontiers. So we are, we're not just making a generic MMO and branding it with Torchlight characters. This is a true Torchlight game. So it's gonna have very similar controls to the original Torchlights. It's gonna have very visceral combat, very good feel and weighty swings to your weapons. People who played Torchlight will be able to sit down and play it immediately, but then they'll discover all the new cool things we can do because it is a persistent world in a shared universe. So Torchlight 1 introduced gamers to the world of Torchlight, and Torchlight 2 let you play it with your friends. But uh, in, in Torchlight Frontiers, we're taking that Torchlight gameplay and we're putting it into a true MMO uh, where you will be enfranchised not just in your character, but also in your place in the world and in the community of players that are there with you. We're also able, with the MMO format, uh, to grow this world. It'll be a living and breathing world that will grow over time and will change over time as we continue to develop for the next, hopefully, several years. We have gone to great lengths to make sure that fans of the Torchlight series will be very happy with what we're making. Uh, it'll feel familiar and yet have all kinds of new stuff for you to play. We cannot wait for you to be able to see what we're making, and that's coming very soon. Very happy today to be able to announce, though, that it exists and that we'll be in communication with you over the next several months and give you more details as we go.